Well, hi there, it's Eric with yet another diving adventure. Well, I've just come from Jones's Beach. Now I'm going to try the old bridge at Birra Lake. And here we are, just coming to the, the debris field where the old bridge was. And you can see one of the pylons that they've cut out. They weren't actually that big, but there were a few of them. I didn't realise they were hollow either. One thing I noticed about the spot is just how much more artefacts have been uncovered. Bottles and pieces of wood that I think come back to the, the time of the old original bridge. There's an interesting bottle I picked up. I have no idea what it is, but I took it home. One of my little souvenirs. And the Coke bottle. There are quite a few of them. I'd say these stem from uh, a time when people were coming home from the old picture theatre at Birra Lake and chucking their stuff over the bridge. More stuff chucked over the bridge for me to pick up a million years later. And here's uh, something, looks like someone nicked from an old takeaway or the old picture theatre, one of the two. Anyway, as I said, uh, the channel's gotten a little bit deeper. It used to be five metres and now it's right on the six metre mark. So a good metre of sand has been ripped off, revealing all this lovely stuff. There's that old wheel that Steve and I uncovered. It's now about a metre above the current sand bed. And it's nice to see some of the old residents are still there. I saw four or five octopus. And there's uh, what looks like some kind of pylon, it's wood. I'm thinking it's either from an old pier or maybe from the old original bridge. Don't know. The fact that it's made out of wood, I'd say it's probably been buried for a long, long time. What looks like an old wooden pylon. You know, all of this stuff was under the sand. Every other dive I've done, I've never seen any of this stuff. And there's some of the fish around a few of the remaining pylons. You can see how much light is there now and the current was really amazing. This is an hour and a half after the peak of high tide. Went and popped my head up under the new bridge. It's amazing to see how much life has already started to attach itself to those pylons. And they go down to about oh, probably four or five metres. So that was it, that was my first dive down at the new bridge and it looks like it's going to be a very interesting place. Anyway, I'll be doing more diving there and I'll uh, keep you up to date. Bye!